All right, so this is really simple. We brought some chorizo refried beans just out of water. We have a Reflectec pouch here that's used generally for cooking hot foods in, putting your just out of water type foods in to let them rehydrate and heat up on the trail. I'm using it as a cooler. What I've done is I have put frozen tortillas in here that have like an enchilada in them, have an enchilada mix in them. And I've frozen them ahead of time and put them in this bag. And that's how I carried them. And then I also have some cheese here, a cheese dip, uh, Mexican type cheese that I also have with that. And then in my bag of cookware, I have a bottle, just an old fireball bottle full of Cholula. Well, about half full of chilo, excuse me. This is what we're gonna to use to cook this dinner with today. It's really simple. And I can carry this stuff easy enough in my backpack. If it is frozen when it goes in this bag overnight, and I can store this in my backpack while I'm hiking during the day. And when I get ready for my lunch or my afternoon meal, I pull it out of here. I add my just out of water to it in my seasoning and I'm ready to rock and roll. Well, let's get this thing cooked up. Let me show you how I'm going to do that. Now today, we're going to use something that we can control the heat on a little better. And something that will cook a little faster. And we're going to use the Trangia stove in conjunction with the firebox. And that's one of the cool things about this firebox is that its adaptability allows that to be done. Now what we have to do is we have to put a couple of our stabilizers in here at the right height and the right width for the stove. And we'll drag this down and kind of look at that and see what that's going to put us, what width we need there. I think we're going to go out here with that. We're going to go there and we're going to go here. Start off with and see what that makes us set. And what we really want is we just want that to snap in just like that. So as long as we accomplish that, we're in good shape. We talk about one pot meals a lot of times. So this is going to be a one skillet meal. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna drop a couple rocks in the bottom of this. We're gonna put a cook rack right on top of those rocks, just like this. Just kind of move them around to get them where you want them so that all four of them are resting the way you want them to on your rack. That's pretty close right there. That gives us space in between the rack and the bottom. Now we can use that to take those enchiladas and bake them very much like you would in an oven. But we're going to use this rack for our oven. So we'll just cook up three of them here. like this and that creates a small oven okay
All right, guys, well, I'm Dave Canterbury with Self Reliance Outfitters in the Pathfinder School, and I appreciate you joining me out here today for this quick Tex Mex skillet dinner. I appreciate your views and I appreciate your support. I thank you for everything you do for our school, for our family, and for our business, all our sponsors, instructors, affiliates, and friends. And I'll be back with another video as soon as I can. Thanks, guys.